So, Mark, okay, I went to this chap and I said, right, here we go, straight away, on a hi hat. Diggity bong. And he went. <laughs> so I said, no, hold it, lad. wait a minute. Uh, no, 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 no. I said, it's the hi hat, it's the hi hat I want, not the bass drum, because the bass drum, you know, it was wow, 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 wow. So I said, hi hat, please. He said, right. <laughs> so I said, no, 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 no. I don't want the bass drum. Not the bass drum, please. It's the hi-hat. Just the hi-hat. That's all I want. Nice and quiet on the hi-hat. Not the bass drum. Boom, 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 boom. So I, I said, do you mind? I'll just come and show you. So I went and I sat down. I said, this is it. It's just... Right. What? OK. I went back up. I did the same thing. And he went... Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> I said, no, 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 I don't want the bass drum at all. It doesn't, there's no bass drum on the music. I don't want the bass drum, just the hi-hat. That's all I want, the hi-hat. And he looked me straight in the eye and he said, listen, mate, I'm delivering milk at five o'clock in the morning. <laughs> So I said, well, why didn't you say? Why didn't you say? <laughs> just leave me two gold tops outside the house. <laughs> what about pit orchestras you work with? You know, I've like... got to tell you that on the Monday night I went to him and I went, right, are you ready? Rump, boom, 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 do go boom. And he went, and he went, What about that cornet? You oh, about. At, at Accrington. Uh, this is with Frank Randall, you know. Uh, and uh, they'd have to get a scratch band in because uh, the Hippodrome Accrington had been closed for a while. So they, they, the local uh, butcher was the cornet player and he got the lovely red face. He, he was perfect. And uh, normally at rehearsals, you, you do the music and then the other lads, they either do a crossword or they chat about the state of the business and things like that in between. Not him. Because we're all sitting out in the stalls, and there's this chap suddenly out of nowhere. He goes, like that. And then above the pit rail, it seemed go. Now, so it came to about Wednesday, and, and again I was working with Norman Teal. He brought a bass on, and I brought the hi hat, and we used to sing uh, uh, Blue Skies. So we ran on like that. I got a high and the dum 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 blue skies, but a pop shining at me, bob and boop pop, and the orchestra had to play pop 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 pop, those sort of things. So about Thursday night, he's framed in the doorway of the dressing room, this guy. Oh hello, he said, how are you doing? All right. He said, uh, I'd like to explain something to you. <laughs> Since I've been studying this rebop. <laughs> And he says, you know that blue skies that you play? Yeah, yeah. Let me loose. <laughs> he says, let me give it something tonight. <laughs> give it some jip. Yeah, let, give it some jip. <laughs> so I said, right, right, off you go. Yeah, please help yourself. And we forgot this, we forgot. And we went out there. This is the bass and the blue skies. And he went, <laughs> shining at me. <laughs> Nothing but blue. <laughs> This. And it was rubbish, absolute rubbish. <laughs> but then he looked up, he looked up and he went... <laughs> <laughs> we couldn't sing, we couldn't sing the second chorus. <laughs> well, well that set the up the, the next piece on the Buddy Rich Band. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, right. We'll talk again in a moment, but for the moment, Roy Castle, thank you very much indeed. Roy Castle. <laughs>